So, uh, you know, a lot of, you, you obviously started a business, you had a business, you've used this to grow a business. Um, and, uh, you know, from whatever you're comfortable sharing, you know, a lot of listeners here are trying to, you know, be able to create a sustainable life, creating content. Uh, do you mind just sharing like from a high level, like the, the income sources that you're experiencing as a, a content creator or where you're, you're targeting uh, your yeah, income yeah, sources yeah, sure. so that you can make a, a living, you know, doing what you're, what you're doing? So the, the the production company, which is the main income source. So you know, we, we I said to our business partner that we've got to expect from, we're not going to get much business from this for three years. It's the production company. I was like, I'm not expecting to get anything at all because we have to build and build authority and credibility and so on. So we said, fine, you know, let's just let's just do it. Um, we started getting business straight like in year one, um, and then this year it pretty much saved our entire business um, because. As a production company, we're filming, and because of YouTube, people found us who were like, "Oh, you know, we never considered video. We need to find it." And then they stumbled across us on YouTube. So, you know, they say eighty percent comes from twenty percent of your clients. That twenty percent of our clients were all booked in for filming throughout the year, and they all went. Mm. We lost our whole thing. A new eighty percent came in within you know four to six weeks. So, when we get out of the pandemic, I'm hoping that we're going to have. <laughs> To eighty percent, sort of. Right. So long, everyone survived. So the content we put on YouTube is not necessarily just through finding us on YouTube. It's also part of our sales process. So if they, someone inquires, you know, I can send them to a bank of content I can trust on. I can playlist it. I can send them to individual videos, and it's really good at helping to convert leads. So that's that side of things. Um, on my own personal side of things, I mentioned at the start, you know, I started this little side business basically just to for a bit of fun and to document what it's like starting a business that you try and grow on YouTube. Um, I think that made like I made a video about it. It did like I think it was nine hundred pounds passive. <laughs> I'm using quotation fingers if you can't see that because the whole video I made about it basically worked out. It cost me fifteen thousand pounds in my own time to produce this passive income. Um, <laughs> right. it work. So. We're sort of adding things to it as we grow. We've got an editing service now, which we can do, you know, all around the world. But when you're a production company in the UK, you've got to look further down the line at how we're going to turn this following into income. So at some point, there will be courses and this consultancy strategy and all these different things that come in. But um, I'd say I think it should be next year or the year after is when I'd dictated it should start to get interesting. Um, but it, it, it worked faster than I expected, actually, which was pretty cool.